In this video, I'm going to show you how to register for a forum and edit your forum signature. Now, before we go any further, let me just say that every forum on the internet is slightly different. So, you might not be able to follow what I say here word for word on every forum, but the general principles are going to be pretty much the same. The web forum that I'm going to use for this demonstration is the Warrior Forum, which you'll find here at warriorforum.com. And it's an internet marketing forum, and it really is an excellent forum. So if you're not already a member, you can use what I'm going to show you in this video to sign up. Okay, first thing to do is come here to where it says register and click. It takes you through to this page where you have to agree to the forum rules. They're fairly straightforward. Uh, and you can see down here and so on and once you've read them and agree to them check the checkbox and then click here where it says register it takes you to this page where you enter your username and password uh, you can use any name you want um, I'm going to use my website address or my Gmail address rather. So I'm going to call this new video for you. And it says this username is valid and is not in use. So now I'm going to enter a password. And then it wants my email address. And then you need to fill out the capture and the random question. And then any additional information like if you were referred by somebody, uh, your time zone. I'm in the UK so I'll put my GMT time zone in there. And then automatically select for daylight savings time. And then your mailing options. Mail from the administrators is one that you want to receive so you should keep that one checked and you can also opt to receive email from other members and then click here to complete the registration then you need to confirm your membership by clicking on the link in your email so I just go to my gmail account now and there we can see the email from the warrior forum so I'll just open that now and just click on the link and there we go everything's now confirmed and you can see I've got the welcome message here it says here you may now proceed to edit your profile and do that click on the link that says profile and it says I have a new private message which is the default welcome message I don't want to read it now so I'll just cancel that for the moment and I can edit my details but the one that I really am interested in for the moment is editing my signature which I'll find here under settings and options. So I'm just going to click on that and here we have the space for my signature and the best thing to do with your signature is to write it out in your word processor first and then copy and paste it in. And then I want to make this link clickable so I highlight it and then click on this icon here. Now with some forums you'll find that you're required to have a minimum number of posts before you can have a clickable link in your signature. Click on there and we've got the URL it's already showing it automatically so click on OK. One thing that the Warrior Forum is very hot on is that you mustn't have affiliate products in your signature. Uh, the link must go to a site that you own or a product that you've made and that you're going to sell. It can't go to an affiliate product that will get you banned from the forum right away. And then what you can do is click here it says preview signature and if I scroll down you can see there it is there's my signature and this will appear underneath every post that I make on the Warrior Forum so when everybody goes to read my posts they can see this at the bottom of every post and it's a great way of driving traffic to your website so there you go 
this is how you sign up for a forum and edit your signature.